Hello everyone, Ace here, and today I've decided to do a video on Battle Cry of Freedom. Now, I've already covered this game before in an Ace Impressions, however, they have actually released a brand new update that's added in some new stuff. A fair bit, so I decided why not go ahead and have another look. So for a start, uh, this brand new update, they ended up adding in some new stuff, such as the ability to create um, the Iron Brigade for the Union, and you also get Zuav Infantry, which is nice as an option. And uh, these guys also have a, uh, a sharpshooter uh, company as well. So yeah, nice. We seem to have some... There we go. But they also added in the Napoleonic Era, which is a mod that has basically gotten official support. As in, you get it as part of the uh, game now when you download the game. So yeah, you can now do Napoleonic Era fighting. So we have the French... And we also have the British, and the British also, if I, here we are, uh, get at their hands on the Baker Rifle of all things. So nice. There's some other new stuff as well, like flare pistols, but let's go ahead and uh, also some new quality of life stuff. We'll do the server browser here. Alright, so it looks like we might have a chance at this one, maybe? Yep, there we go. So we should be able to actually jump into a Napoleonic era map here. I've also seen some stuff for World War I and uh, War of 1812, so they might end up introducing that as well. That would actually be nice, I think. Anyways, let's go ahead and... get into the match here. It's probably going to take a little bit to actually jump in because I'm pretty sure this is going to be just good old-fashioned uh, conquest. However... There we go. Now we do have to wait until the fighting is actually over and it looks like it has just started so I'll go ahead and I might end up skipping to when we actually get to be in game because this is just regular commander mode and not uh, commander conquest so alright so the French won that last one so we'll try spawning in as British we will go for the elite rifle uh, light uh, infantry so the 95th and that should give us access to the Baker. We're probably not going to be that good on numbers, though, but that's okay. Plan to get into position first and then let my dudes um, follow up with me. I'm going to try to keep in line with the rest of the guys, though, so we can not get spread out too badly. But yeah, they have done a few improvements, though, since uh, the last update. For example, aiming down the sights has been improved. You can also see the weapons sway a lot more. It feels janky, admittedly, a little bit, but it, do it does certainly give it uh, the animations a little bit more fluidity, in my opinion. Also, um, there's been improvements to being able to reload on the move, which is a, well, it's a useful thing to do in this game, to be sure. But yeah, like I said, this uh, mod comes with the game now, so it is actually officially supported, I would say. So yeah, uh, if you wanted more than just the American Civil War, well, here you go as an option. Alright, so I will actually take a position right here. We'll see how this goes. I know that I don't actually have any binoculars uh, on this kit here, so I do have lanterns for night fighting, although not really sure how much that's going to help here.
Oh, looks like the fighting's taking place over here. Order my guys to space up the ranks. A little bit um, long in the range here for these, which is why that wasn't very effective, but. We can. I push. I'm pretty sure we can get into position here. Start firing at this distance. We should be able to start hitting something. Space out the ranks. We need to get a little bit closer. I'm wondering if there is a good way I can flank around them. So long as we don't... So long as we can avoid the water, we should be good, and then we can potentially... Okay, I'm going to order my guys to form column. Because we need to get across this little waterway here. Or in between in this little area here and then we can start flanking. looks like enemy artillery we are in a perfect position to actually start flanking the artillery here and we can hopefully assuming we get in position fast enough we can potentially take these guys out deny them their artillery and how are we doing as far as numbers it's actually an even fight Okay. Hello! <laughs> You're about to have a really bad day. Surrender. Or not. Okay. <laughs> the, the last dude left is running for his life. <laughs> okay, he did get one of us, but I don't care. He got absolutely wrecked. We got him. Alright, let's try reloading this bad boy. Or not. I guess it only really works if you're dealing with... Um, Okay, now that we've actually flanked them, though, we can actually just start peppering these guys from behind before they even realize they're in a world of hurt. Oh, this is going to be so beautiful. <laughs> oh, God. We actually got a headshot on that, which is amazing. Okay, they do have us, but... Unfortunately for them, we still have... We still have plenty of dudes left, so I think we actually have the numbers advantage here. They're gonna try charging. Unfortunately for them, I still have... I, it's not what I wanted, but okay. 
And that was my fault. I misclicked. I selected the wrong order by accident. Okay, fine. Okay, oop. I am making a fool out of myself here. I immediately regret this decision. Okay, they got me. But, I think we got enough of them that it doesn't really matter anymore. Even with that little mistake of mine. I should not have charged, but unfortunately I selected that instead of firing. Yes, he did actually fire, but uh, I don't really think it was that effective, so... I think the French are going to lose this one, so... I think it's the last French player left. Yep. Good work, boys. We did it. All right. So, yeah. I think that's a good time to go ahead and call it. But, yeah. I think that is a nice little update and something worth playing, in my opinion. Even though I kind of messed up at the end there, I certainly had fun. But, uh, yeah, since we go ahead and get through this, I'll go ahead and leave, and, um, yeah. Come on, all right. Da, 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 da. All right, there we go. Now, we'll go ahead and exit to main menu. There's other stuff too, and yeah, I know it's kind of lagging out. I think it might be because I'm I've got this on an external, so that's probably why. But uh, yeah, a fun game I already recommended before, but now they added it in the Napoleonic era, which is nice. And of course, it does change up the gameplay a little bit, I think. So uh, yeah. In any case, this has been Ace. Hope to see you guys again soon. Take care. Ace out.